Hello everybody and welcome back to more Mario Kart Wii Wi-Fi races. <clears throat> this is part 7. And here we are getting ready to jump right into the uh, first race here. I'm just doing uh, some more random races, not uh, joined by anyone from YouTube in this video, I don't believe. <clears throat> but uh, let's see where we're going to go here to start off this uh, for to start off this video here. And it looks like N64 Sherbet Land. And I'll be honest with you, uh, <clears throat> out of all the retro courses on this game, this one's probably my least favorite. I just don't like it at all, hardly. I mean, I don't like, I mean, it's, I guess it's not that bad, but it's just not one of my favorites, really. I mean, I'll race it, just to do it. I always end up doing something stupid and hitting a penguin and messing up, though. But, uh, here I am in second, got green shells, and I just, I hit that guy with a green shell there. <clears throat> and, uh, on this, in this video, I'm using Luigi on the mock bike, and I just ran into that wall there. And I did it again, jeez. Get my get your crap together today, man. Quit, quit running into the wall. But uh, I I just I picked Luigi on the mock bike in this video just for a change because I've been using my me pretty much all the time. So I just figured why not do something different and pick Luigi. I mean, since I use Luigi in the N64 Mario Kart, I might as well try him out in this one, right? And I got red shells now. Throwing those at everyone. And uh, here we go through the second lap now. And I got my triple bananas. And someone's out in first by themselves. And I don't really know who that is. It's someone using Daisy. Someone named Zach. And I just passed him and took back first place. Let's hope I can keep it this time and not do anything else stupid. Alright, and I got hit with lightning there and lost my bananas, of course. Uh, come on, keep first place, please keep first. I got serious, serious ex or serious radio playing in the uh, background. If uh, you hear any background noise in this video, that's what it is. I'm re listening to uh, serious uh, lithium. It's alter 90s alternative and grunge. It's a pretty good radio station, actually. God, I see what I mean. I I always I always hit one of these penguins. It never fails. I cannot race this track without hitting a penguin at least once. But uh, I'm I got a pretty good lead here. It looks like I'm gonna take first. And I did. I took first place. And I got uh, 29 points for that. Not too bad. But uh, let's jump right into the uh, next race here and see where we're going. SNES Mario Circuit 3. Well, heck, I'm, I believe the last time we were here was in uh, Mario Kart Wii Wi-Fi Races Part 1. All the way back to the first video was the last time we was at this track. And as I mentioned then, I like this track. It's pretty cool. It's definitely for manuals, though. If you're an automatic user, you're not going to be very good at this track. Unless you get lucky. This track is definitely made for manual users. Considering all the turns and everything. And here I am out at first being followed by, uh that daisy user again 
and I'm starting to pull away a little bit it looks like let's just hope I can keep pulling away and keep this lead here okay coming around the second lap now still in first so far I've been lucky to avoid any of hits or attacks by anything. There's a pow block. That's really the first hit I've had in this race. It didn't really slow me down much. And now I got a pretty, uh... I got a, looks, what looks like a pretty insurmountable lead now. It looks like I'm gonna take first place in this one unless, uh, I just get bombarded with items or something. Whoa, watch out for that green shell there. And I took first place once again. Alright. And 21 points. Oh, even flows on. Awesome. Awesome song. And hopping right into the third race now. And we're going to Koopa Cave. I believe this is the first time we've covered this track in my Mario Kart Wii uh, races series so far. But, uh, this is a pretty cool track. I like it alright. It's actually pretty innovative, really, with some of the, some of the stuff it does. It's, it's really a pretty neat, neat, uh, track. I'm dropping a fake item block there, and, uh, someone ran into that. And, uh, get away from me with that, uh, Mega Mushroom, that plushie. <clears throat> Still in first here. I've not been caught yet, really, in this video at all. Except for at Sherbet Land, because I screwed up a little bit. And here we go down to the pipe. Now, this is one of my favorite, uh, parts of the track. See, you're actually, you're in this little pipe, but you're actually under the water, and you can see everything that's going on down there. Underneath, you can see that eel, that big eel, if you remember. If you've ever played, uh, Super, or, uh, Mario 64, you remember that giant eel from the water level, it's down there. <coughs> see, all in all, this is a pretty cool track. Got hit with a pal there, and lost my triple bananas, which sucks. Then I got hit with a blue shell, and I finally got passed by Sanji. <clears throat> Just gonna have to pass that person back, ain't I? That person's using Wario on the, uh, looks like the Wario bike. <laughs> that's, that's pretty humorous. You rarely see someone using that. At least I don't. I got a mushroom. I got a mushroom in first? Wow. I'm going to cut across the grass there. Back down uh, here into the pipe. And I'm back in first place on the second lap. Someone behind me had a lightning cloud. They better just stay away from me with that thing. Alright. <clears throat> Coming around here now. Going on to the final lap in first place. And I've actually started to pull a, a nice lead, a little bit of a nice lead here. Just hope I can keep it. Another pal there. Alright, coming here through the final lap. Dun -dun -dun -dun. I like Pearl Jam, they're great. Oh, do, oh, do not hit one of those beams, by the way. If you hit one of those uh, beams going around there, it acts as a uh, lightning, acts as if you got hit by lightning and shrinks you for a period of time. So, uh, yeah, it's not good to hit those. And it uh, looks like we're going to take first place once again at the Koopa Cape. All right. But anyway, guys, I'm running out of time. This is the end of this video. If you like my videos, please rate and subscribe, and I'll see you later.